What's going on guys, it's Cliffy here. Today we're playing... Oh crap, I think this is going to go out on the full. Oh, it did, I picked it. I knew it, the wind was there, it just was not happening and that is not the way we want to start this game. Today we're playing against the Canterbury Bankstown Bulldogs. Oh, and that's not out either. Go son! All the bloody way! Oh, what a start to this game. This has been entertainment off all these fans that are here. I don't even know where we're playing today, but entertainment value. Uh, in essentially today, what is a clash for the wooden spoon? 15 plays 16, and the winner today, I mean, if we win, and I mean, points differential goes our way, potentially we could bump ourselves up to about 13th, but somehow I don't really see that happening. Go, son. God, we're getting close. What a start. Oh, and then he just gets driven back five or so metres. And we get a repeat set of six. That's what we've really been missing. Like, in attack, we've just been missing that chance to go and just really apply the pressure and get those repeat sets. And quite often in rugby league, that is what gets you those tries. And I'm going to go a bit off topic here. Talk about another rugby, rugby union. Um, starting off first, we are in the quarterfinal stage of the World Cup. Um, South Africa just narrowly beaten Wales. Um, I think they got a try in the last five minutes. Oh, we've got to score this surely uh, to win that one. Then uh, the other game was the All Blacks taking on France, which we all know the All Blacks just absolutely destroyed. Oh no. Oh no. Same old Warriors, just doing this same old stuff. And then this morning, Argentina beat Ireland, which was a, a little bit of a shock. And then the Australians just got out against the Scottish. Oh, what a what a matchup it would have been had the, had the Scots won. How amazing would that, would have that been. But back now to the Rugby League. And it's just been like, it's been same old, same old for the Warriors. Like, we had an opportunity there, we had a repeat set of six, and we just go and make a silly mistake. And that is just, that has been story of our season. And I think that's why we're so low down towards, well, we are at the bottom of the table, but why we've been down there for a majority of the season is just because of those mistakes. Like, we just haven't really been able to put the finishing products on there or just continually... Uh, keep applying that pressure, so, oh my god, see, like that there, just trying to make something happen, try and keep the ball alive, and just hope for something, because that, that is all we have really done, is just try and keep the ball alive, and just hope for something special, which hasn't come our way so far this season, but hopefully in this last game, this dead rubber game, uh, well, it's not a dead rubber, I mean, we're playing for, we're playing off for the wooden spoon, we need, we need something, we need something just to make it work. Just allow us not to get the wooden spoon. That's what we want. I'll play that inside ball. Where's the winger? What is he doing? Everyone's out of position. Don't know what we're doing. We're a mess. See, when we keep the ball alive like that there, like try and get those offloads away, that's where we're most dangerous. Oh, God. Oh, I've kicked it straight down his throat. Strategical kicking and in-game kicking is something I think I really need to work on. Try and get, again, it goes back to that point of getting those repeat sets, uh, getting extra, you know, and that's that's really what we need. Getting those 40-20s, you know, getting those line dropouts. What is my dog barking at? There must be someone there. He's going crazy. I don't know if you can hear him in the background, but he's going crazy. Go, Cliffy! No! Oh, I should have done the goose step. All right, but this is this is an opportunity. We've got to score here. We've got to score here. We have had the run of the first half. We've got to go and make a difference. Saying that though, last time around when we played the West Tigers, who I think were like, they were in the top eight, and we were doing real well, defended really well, played really well. Um, I think I set up our only try of the game, uh, and then, oh, and then after that, like I think I was subbed off. They scored a try and got a field goal, and then that was that. Oh, go you big thing, come on. T 
Take the one point, boys. Take the field goal. That's what we want to see. We've got a lead. We've deserved a lead in this first half, and that's what we've gone and done. We've gone, got the lead. It may only be one point, but we are going to continue to keep the ball, and we're going to get it in the... Um, oh, oh, if only he could have got an offload away there. Had he got an offload away, we were in. He's still going crazy, the dog. He's going mad. Here we go. So now we've got it. The only problem is now we have the wind at our back in this half. And that's what really led us to uh, well that first mistake of the game, which was the ball obviously going out on the fall from the kickoff. And um, hopefully that wind isn't going to play too big of a role in this second half because we do have the lead. It may only be by one point, but a lead is a lead. And we deserve it. Like, we deserve uh, we deserve to try in that first half. We should have scored a try on probably a couple of occasions when we had that repeat set. Oh, man. But we just can't seem to break the line. Ever. And Buddy... Is it Richardson? It's Buddy Richardson. Does nothing for me. He just doesn't... See, look at that kick. That kick's gone hardly anywhere. Cliffy again with a, with a tackle. Another tackle. He sh I should have made my guy... He should be playing number nine. He should be playing hooker. Because the amount of tackles that he makes and the workload that he gets through is just incredible. Oh, stripped. Should have gone the other side. And I, I mean, I can't do any worse than Richardson. He's terrible. He's always making mistakes. He's always just trying to trying to take on the line. Oh, look at that. Go, boys. They just don't seem to have the, quite the awareness that they need. Like, when they Oh, God. Like, when there's a chance to play it out wide, pass it out wide, they just don't seem to do it. Get the offloads away. Get the cheeky offloads away. That's what we need. Oh, I was going to say, don't get, don't get the ball stripped. I'm going to go for another field goal. Another cheeky field goal. Just keep the points. Just keep them going over. That's what we need to do. For some reason, I don't know why it is, but when I seem to be playing rugby league live, my cam... And my gameplay seems to go out of sync just a little bit. So I do apologise for that if that is happening. Uh, but we've got the lead, so 2-0. But I really I really think we need a try soon. I think we just need need a bit of that insurance. And we just don't... We just can't seem to make those gains. You know, those first couple of tackles, we just can't seem to make the gains that the other teams can make. We just get smothered down in our own half. And that's a problem half the time. That means that we got to go and try and do something magical, you know, play that miracle ball. Like there was a, that was an excellent chance for an offload. Why it wasn't offloaded? No one will know. Okay, so this again, this is going to be difficult, kicking, kicking into that breeze. But we've got to try and just make the best of a bad situation. And that's what I've tried to do by going for the big diving tackle around the uh, around the bootlaces. Come on, boys. Just keep this defense up. We've only got 15 minutes to survive. Oh, no. Breaks out of a tackle of mine again. Not this time, though. Cliffy says, nah, -uh. Not this time, buddy. There we go. So another good... Well, a good set from the Bulldogs, getting 44 metres. Yeah, you take it. Oh, great take. Up in the air, confident as ever. And just bangs it in. See, that? there's another situation. That's what I was just talking about. You just need just need that awareness just to, to keep going and just play that quick pass. Just shovel it along. Better get in position. Ooh, 
Ooh, that was risky. Nearly an intercept. We're up to the 40, though. I don't think we're going to get possession again. Oh, that's a smart kick. Would have been even smarter had the chase been a bit better. We'd run up on him and tackled him into touch. Keep possession. That's what we needed, but just four minutes left to go. Oh, just a wee little ankle tap from Cliffy does enough. We probably are going to get the ball again. I was going to say, it won't be for very long. We might only get it for a tackle. Oh, intercept. And that'll do. That'll be the game. The Warriors will not pick up the wooden spoon. Just take, yeah, I was going to say, just take it into contact. Just take the tackle. No errors, and the Warriors have managed to go. Because we haven't won by five points or more, I don't think we're going to be able to sneak up to 13th. But we might actually go 14th now, possibly, depending on our points differential, not goal differential. And uh, we level up as well, so that's a, a very positive sign. Going to put that up on fitness, because fitness is something that really does seem to be getting there. Well, not really getting there for me. And as we can see, the Warriors avoid the wooden spoon. The Bulldogs get it. We go to 21 points for this season. Six wins and just a... Well, five draws. I was going to say just the five draws, but five draws. That is very, very incredible. So um, the Warriors have finished in 14th position and have missed out on the final. So a bit of a bugger there, but I mean, hey, we've gone... Progressed through the season, I guess you'd say. Scored a try in the season, but set up a few... Defense is getting better, the players getting better week in, week out, which is what we want to see. But anyway, guys, do hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please remember to leave a like. If you are new, please do subscribe. Holy crap! I got player of the year and people's choice of the year and five eighth of the year. You ripper! Man, we smashed it. We won by 20 points. Oh, that is cool. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. And we've got some contract offers. You receive contract offers from the clubs listed below. This is what I was actually waiting for. This is what I was waiting uh, to try and, I guess, let you guys decide as well. So, Holden Cup, West Tigers. I'm going to re-sign with the Warriors. Two-year deal in the Holden Cup. Um, but, I mean, we're re-signed now uh, on a much bigger contract as well. Almost double. Well, actually, over double. Um what originally we were earning so we're going to carry on with the warriors hopefully next season will be a bit of a better season for us as i said hope you've enjoyed the video if you have please remember to leave a like if you are new please do subscribe make sure you check out my facebook and twitter links that can be found down below in the description hope you're having a good week make sure you tune in tomorrow cliffy's champions league round five i think we're in make sure you do not miss that